fashion show, fashion show, fashion show at lunch. Fashion show, fashion show, fashion show at lunch. Okay, if you watch The Office, you get what I just said. If you don't watch The Office, um, might I suggest starting to watch it and see Mindy Kelly's response to when Jenna Fisher ordered some clothes and Mindy wanted a fashion show at lunch. My thing is, there's not really going to be a fashion show at lunch, but there's going to be an eyeglass readers fashion show that you can watch at lunch or at breakfast or at snack time or at dinner. Um, I have decided to have fun with a video today. As you know, or maybe you don't know, I <laughs> had the second cataract surgery over almost two weeks ago. And it's been life-changing because I can't begin to tell you how great my eyes are. And even before the surgery, my ophthalmologist told me that like, you know, your eyes are really bad. So after I had the surgery and I had the basic, I didn't have any special like $10,000 plus lens. I had what my horrible health insurance afforded me. So I had the basic lens. I, 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 I'm still in shock. Every day is a brand new day as far as I'm concerned because I am able to see without glasses. The only reason that I wear glasses now um, is because I do need readers for reading on my iPhone or reading a book up close or being on my computer. So I do have two different strengths of readers. These are from Walmart. They were less than $10 and yeah, they're, oh my God, they're filthy. But um, they were less than $10. The um, magnification is 1.75. So I'm working with a pretty low magnification. Now for other kind of readings, I do, I did buy another magnification of 2.00 which helped me more at work. It could be because of the lighting, it could be because the I'm working on two computers, but between these two, between the 175 and the 200, um, both seem to work really well. I did order a pair of sunglasses with no, like, like no number. They're just like plain sunglasses and I will be showing them to you. And they're like nothing. I can see perfectly with them when I'm driving during the day. And it's just like, it, it's freaking amazing. I went out to dinner Thursday night with one of my really good friends. And I drove back in rain and on the Philadelphia Schuylkill back to King of Prussia. And I was able to see perfectly, like perfectly. That is such a big thing for me because trust me, it was the first time that I've ever driven at night without glasses, without any assistance. So it was so special to me. So I'm just having fun now. I donated my prescription glasses because I can't use them anymore. They're obsolete for me. I don't need them. I have a pair upstairs of my Ray-Ban sunglasses that are prescription. I tried them on today to see how, you know, just because. And later on this afternoon, I'm going to drop them off at an eyeglass donation center because I can't even, I, I, I can't even see out of them. The one thing that I'm sad about is those Ray-Bans were my favorite sunglasses of all time. but you know what? It's time to move on. And without further ado, I'm going to show you what I got. So, and I decided to wear Jameson to show off these glasses because I think she works with all of them. So this is Jameson 
by Aesthetica Designs. So here we go. I love round frame glasses. Like I love them. I think for my angular face, because I have a very I, totally square, I'm like sponge barber square pants, like crazy. So I need something to soften my face, whether it comes from wearing layered hairstyles or whatnot. But I really do need a round frame to kind of soften the angles in like in my face. That's like, that's it. That's it. So I picked these up at Walmart. Actually, the day after I had my second surgery, my eye doc, my ophthalmologist said, look, you don't need prescription glasses anymore. Do yourself a favor. Go to a pharmacy, try on a couple of pair of reading glasses, take your phone, see which one works when you're reading. And that's it. Like, that's all you need. So that's what I did. This is a 1.75. I like a larger frame. I don't like a small frame on me. You know, my glasses are my security blanket. And trust me, even as I look like into the computer now, I'm still not used to me without glasses. And I don't need them. That's what's so weird is that I still, it's like I'm looking at me and I'm like, oh my God, like it's me, but it's not me because I'm so used to glasses. So anyway, I picked these up. It's a tortoiseshell frame. The only thing that I don't like about these, I can't stand these uh, like these stripes, but my hair cut, my fake hair covers it. But really it's like, if they didn't have these stripes, I would have bought like four pair of these and kept one in every purse, but they're lightweight. They're not heavy. And that's another thing that's really great. My lenses in my prescription glasses were so heavy that uh, like uh, it was crazy. Now I'm just wearing like readers like this and they're incredibly lightweight. So that is number one. Now I have another pair. And these were sent to me by my daughter, Una. Una um, went on to Amazon and purchased a couple of pair of reading glasses and blue light glasses for computer usage. And I was so thrilled. That was so thoughtful. You know, my daughter, she's good to me. So here we go. I love these. And these are way outside the box for me because of the color of the frame. I like a dark frame. This is so light, but yet it works. Like I really, really love these. And I was so surprised. Um, unfortunately, I don't have the brand name of these glasses, but they are on Amazon. They're, again, Una knows my taste. They're a large frame and they're rounded. Hold on, I'll show them. Hmm. See? The frame is light, but yet you can still see that I'm wearing glasses. So that's a good thing. And they came in a really nice case too. Look at that. It's nice and strong. It's not going anywhere. I, I, I have a wardrobe of reading glasses now. Okay, now I'm going to show you the other glasses that my daughter sent me. Again, I have to open up the... You know, it's an amazing thing because even though I can see... I'm still very clumsy. Why isn't this opening? Well, welcome to my world. Okay, here we go. Here they are.
these remind me a lot of the prescription glasses that I had before I had the surgery. And I really like these a lot. The lens is slightly tinted, like you can just tell a little bit that there's slight tinting in here, which makes it great for computer use. I used these the other day at work and they really held up nicely. I, my eyes were not bothering me at all. And when I go outside, this very, 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 very faint tint really makes things comfortable. So again, this is by T-I-J-N, Jijin. And again, this is an Amazon brand. You can see these better. This is a rounded frame and they are large enough to fit my face. They're very lightweight as well. Plastic, super comfy, and they weren't expensive either. So now I'm gonna show you two more pairs that I got. I don't know if you're familiar with the glasses from Peepers, that's P-E-E-P-E-R-S, but they're pretty popular online like reading glasses company. Now this kind of goes outside what I typically like because these frames are a little bit more like square than I'm used to, but even though they're square, they still have that rounded edge. I love these because they're super big and I like the thickness of the frames. Like these are badass. And I love the fact that these are such strong, like when I, I don't mean strong as far as lens goes, I mean strongly constructed. Now this Peepers company, I purchased these and sunglasses and they were both $25 a piece. They're not expensive by any means, but they're not as um, inexpensive as the drugstore kind that you will get for like 10 or $15. But hold on, I'm going to change my hair, okay? Because I want to show you how different glasses look with different wigs. So hold on and I will be right back, okay? Hold on. And this is Orchid by Aesthetica Design in the color Chrome RT1B. Look, it's like gray hair and she's absolutely gorgeous and she's longer. But look, the glasses still look really great with different hair. It's amazing. Check this out. Like I freaking love these frames so much. Look at them. I'm so glad, I'm so glad that I made the purchase. So here we go, here's what they look like again. Now these are slightly magnified, okay? And the magnification is fine, it's not bothering my eyes. I would never drive with these simply because they're too magnified. But for reading a novel or for even in front of the computer, these are really, really great. And they're so sturdy. And tortoise, I freaking love tortoiseshell. I love tortoiseshell glasses. But look, and my makeup looks really good. Oh my God. And I'm allowed to wear makeup now. I got the get go for makeup. So I'm like in seventh heaven here. But look. Okay, so those are the ones from Peepers. Now I am waiting for a really kind of like expensive pair. Um, my husband took me to Warby Parker a couple, well, last week, yeah, last Saturday we went to Warby Parker and I ordered a pair of Warby Parker. I don't know why, like that brand is such a tongue twister for me. Warby Parker. Um, I bought a pair of their glasses in the 1.75 density. And that's the good thing about Warby Parker. 
is that you can buy a reading glass lens. Um, because of COVID, it's taking a little bit longer to receive them by mail. So I did get a tracking notice that tomorrow is the day that I am supposed to be getting them. So I will be able to show them to you at a different date. So now I'm going to show you the sunglasses that I purchased from Peepers. Again, it's the same frame. It's the same frame as these, only in sunglasses. Check it out. I know that these lenses don't, oh, wait a minute. Hold on, Oops, I made a mistake. I bought two pairs of the readers. Hold on, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Um, and I have, I, I made a mistake. What happened was these are the actual frames that I ordered recently from Peepers. These do have the blue light so that I can see the computer a lot better. And these are the ones that I wore to work, okay? You can see that there is a slight, just ever so slight darkening, simply because these are meant to be worn watching a computer or actually working on a computer. I am so horrible. I like, it's like all these other people that are on YouTube, they like, rock it out of the ballpark. I can't even do that because I always mess up. So, okay, these are the ones, these are the peepers that I had purchased, oh God, a few years back. And the reason that I purchased these was because I had this great idea that I would order a pair of readers for the beach so that I could read at the beach and leave my good glasses at home. Well, that didn't transpire simply because these still were not strong enough for me when I had those heavy duty prescription lenses. So these sat in a drawer. Luckily, I can wear them. So I do have a whole series of readers that I can, like, I can wear. It's like fashion show, fashion show, fashion show at lunch. Okay, here's the sunglasses. Yes, yes. I love these. You have no idea how much I love these, but I'm gonna tell you, simply because I have never been able to wear sunglasses that aren't prescription. Like, it's crazy. In the past, I have purchased sunglasses that didn't need a prescription and I couldn't see Jack out of them. I always ended up giving them away. Um, look, like, does this look Hollywood or what? I'm gonna take this off and I'm gonna put Jameson back on because she looks, as one of my friends said, very chic with Jameson. Hold on. <sighs> you know, it's not easy to put wigs on and off in front of a camera. <laughs> Let me move her to the side more. There we go. Look at that. I feel like I'm back in Manhattan during the days when the boys went to school at St. Ignatius on the Upper East Side on right off of Park Avenue. This is very Upper East Side. I love it. Like I stinking love the way these glasses look. And I'm giddy as a little schoolgirl simply because I have never been able to wear sunglasses like this before. Like, never. It's incredible. I am so shocked and I am so happy because now I can have a wardrobe of glasses. I mean, my, 
my prescription sunglasses that I had that I no longer need that I will be donating later, they were like $500. And like my glasses, my prescription glasses were just as much. So like, I'm not, it's like for $200, I'm getting an entire wardrobe of fun eyeglasses. But I just wanna show you one more um, pair of glasses that I purchased a long time ago. Actually, I think they're Una's, I'm not too sure. I think this was in the days where I thought that maybe I could get away with not wearing prescription glasses, but these are a little bit elaborate for me. They're by Juicy Couture. Um, I'm usually not into this whole shebang over here, but here are the glasses and I can see out of them. Like I can see out of these. These are going to be my automobile sunnies. I'm going to leave these in the car while I use these in my purse. Um, who knew? Who stinking knew? So that's it. I'm sorry if I, like, I'm sorry if this was an annoying video, um, but it's so much fun to have glasses that you don't need. I mean, it, it's insane. But the thing is, I really do love the way that I look in glasses because I'm so used to it. I've gone like this for my whole life. And now I'm glad that there is an option. I'm glad that my eyes are so much better and that I have the gift of sight now. But I'm also glad that there are options that even though I don't need eyeglasses in prescriptions, I can still wear them only for reading and I can even get a plain lens if I want. Because trust me, I mean, take a look at this, okay? Glasses, not glasses. Glasses, not glasses. Glasses, they're like poor, they're like poor woman's Botox for the eyes. I can't, like, I can't afford fillers right now. And I have those like kind of like shallow bags under my eyes. And you can, you can see it right now, but look. With the glasses on, you're paying more attention to my glasses. So that was it. I'll put the links, so to speak, or the companies of the glasses that I bought down below. So if you want to check out their websites, you can. Um, it's fun. Oh wait, I have an Amazon. I I have an Amazon influencer account. So the glasses that I have on that I that my daughter got from Amazon. I'll put the links from my account in there because I do get like a monetary compensation when things are um, sold. So maybe I'll be able to afford fillers after all. Ha <laughs> ha, only joking, only, only joking, only joking. So that's it for fashion show at lunch. I will see you later. Just have a great day. Have a great week. Why do I, I keep saying, have a great wig. Have a great week. Look at the world through rose-colored glasses or look at the world through no glasses at all. Just look at the world and have a good time. Take care now and I will see you next week. Bye-bye.